Dr. Price of Alan Courtney. Alan Courtney's dead. Are you sure of Marty? Once Marty is told the secret that gives the judge his power. You will kill Godak, the present judge, to take his place and do as we say in the middle jungle. What has happened to Lothel? Well, many of the Tongili no longer believe in their mystery queen of jungle. Marty must arrange her execution as soon as he's in power. Now, what about Courtney's niece, Pamela, and the two Americans? When last seen, they were approaching Courtney's camp. Marty should be attending to them now. I'll free the animals. I'll them in or try to recapture them, you creep. I know what to do now. Uncle must have meant that Lothel knows the secret. That's the only logical reason for him mentioning her. Now that we need to talk to Queenie, we'll probably never see her again. Some of the cats are loose. the same men that murdered her uncle freed those cats. Yeah, to give him a chance to get the pam while we was wrestling with the animals. Say, I better see if those pets are all right. Get the snares. The cats are so busy fighting, we ought to catch them easy. I turned the animals loose. What happened? Well, one of the men knocked the girl down. The spear passed over where she was standing. What do we do now? You stay here. I'm going back and listen. Cats won't bother us now. Are they on consignment? Yeah, to a museum. Got them all ready to ship. Look here. We're getting ourselves quite a collection of weapons. First a Mauser, now this hunting knife. And a Tongili spear thrown in for a dividend. There's only one place a Tongili got the rifle in this knife. Nazis. Yeah, the same Nazis who don't want us to learn the secret of the sword of Tongu. That's the reason they murdered your uncle, Pam. He could tell you the secret. I wonder if Godak, the new judge of the tribes, would listen to me. After all, I am Alan Courtney's niece. No, we don't have to take that chance yet. Your uncle mentioned Lothel. If Queenie would only stay put for a little while, it'd be okay, but... I'm going to Tongara. Tongara? What for? To convince Godak that the Germans killed his friend, Mr. Courtney, and to ask him about Lothel. Yeah, no one except the Tongili has ever been there or talked with a judge. Except Mr. Courtney. You went there with him, didn't you? Uh, yes, but... I didn't count. <laughs> you do now. You know the way, and the Tongili will recognize you. Oh, when do we start? Oh, no, Chuck. You take Pam and Mr. Courtney's body back to Tambosa. Jungle Jack will furnish you with an escort from the safari boys. Someone has to tell the authorities there what happened. A fine pal you turn out to be. OK, OK. If I don't see you again, I'll look for your head on a pole outside some native village. <laughs> don't worry, chum. I'll still wink at you. <laughs> Anything, Marty? What I heard will help the boy on the land when I tell him in the morning. Hello? Oh, Weber. Oh, he is. Well, put him on. Well, it's about time you reported, Lang. What kept you so long? 
I phoned as soon as I talked to Marty. Miss Courtney and the Americans are still alive. Alan Courtney's murder has backfired. Backfired? How? Well, Godak is now inclined to believe that Lothel's warnings are true. I thought you planned to make it appear as though the Americans were responsible for the killing. I can't. The Tongiti spear was thrown at Miss Courtney. It shouldn't have been, but it was. If Godak hears about it, he won't believe Marty. And one of the Americans is going to him now. The American must never get there. What about the girl and the other man? Well, they're taking Alan Courtney's body to Tambosa. They won't be molested. The Tangili respect the mourners of the honored dead. In that case, I shall attend to them myself when they reach town. Now, what about Marty? Naturally, he's worried, and so am I. We have depended too much upon Marty. This time, have him do exactly what I'm now going to tell you. Every time I hear the jungle telegraph, I think something's up. That usually is. What do the drums say? Godak wants the chiefs to come see him. I hope it ain't a reception committee for Bob. saying now. Kodak has called a meeting to discuss Mr. Courtney's murder. Well, there's really a good chance that he'll listen to us if we get to him. Yes, if we get to him. We have come just like Marty said. Yes, we take the secret trail and report to Marty. Strangers coming to our village. Good. That's what we wanted to know. How long will it be before they arrive? I do not know. I have other warriors watching. They'll come tell us in time. Mm -hmm. That gong means that Godak has gone to put on his robes. When the gong stops, Godak will be at the upper throne. Good. Are you sure you can do exactly as I've told you? You're smart, Guana Lang. Your plan will make me the judge. Well, I'm glad you approve. I'll wait here. Judge, but Wana Lang's plan is good. Late. Where's Godak? I've just escorted him as usual to the robing chamber. Should be here now. Does it not seem strange, Kyber, that Godak waits so long? We waited before. Why not now? I am made suspicious by all that has happened recently in the jungle. What do you mean? I think that Godak, our judge, should be guarded more carefully. Let us go to him. This is Godak, judge of the Tangili. Well, 
This time everything's working all right. Bring him along. suggested that Kaiba succeed Godak. Lafayette, who warned against strangers, is a stranger herself, and a friend of strangers. Ask those strangers where Godak is now. And Lafayette answers. Marty sneaks into the jungle and talks there with your enemy. Ask Marty what he has promised those men if he has chosen to succeed Godak. Do you believe this woman who has tricked us before, saying she did it to help us? Or do you believe me? Ah. Look! Look there! Strangers come to Tangara. Kaiba, we shall see now who likes strangers best, you or me. I was thinking. Listen. Chance to talk to the Tongili now. What's the matter? Bodak's disappeared. Say, there's no place for us. One of those strangers is your friend, Kaiba. And the Thales. Why are they here now, just when Godak has disappeared? Tongilis, or else he'd be right behind us. They're keeping out of range. Yeah, no doubt about it. But if I know him, there's something more to it than this. Something more to it than this is right. Look. Uh -huh. 